Hi, my name is Martin Smith from Gary Studio. I'm going to talk to you today briefly about preparing for the studio. The watchword is rehearse. Rehearse, rehearse, rehearse. And I don't mean just go through it once and think, yeah, that'll be all right and go in. Um, you make your own luck when you're going into a studio. Studio essentially is an alien environment, even though you may have been in studios before. If you don't live in them like I do, then they are an alien environment, believe me. Um, so the more you rehearse, then the luckier you're going to be on the day. Um, and that means um, rehearsing maybe without the singer singing it, because that may be a situation that, that may come up. So be a, as a band, being able to, you know, being, being able to play the song without being able to hear the singer very clearly, because sometimes that can be an issue. Um, also, for singers that are just playing to a backing track or something like that, you just rehearse it and rehearse it and rehearse it and rehearse it until you're sick of it. Um, because when you go into the studio, you'll be pleased of that time that you've put in. It's money in the bank, it really is. And it's, it's money that you save in the studio to put no finer point on it. So, um, <clears throat> And if you, if you have a chance to record on any kind of rudi rudimentary equipment, it doesn't matter what it is, um, so you have a chance to hear back, get an impression of what you sound like, um, so it's not a huge surprise when you go into the studio. Obviously, when you go into the studio, hopefully it's going to sound a million times better, but at least you've got an idea of what you sound like, A, and B, you can correct things in rehearsal that may, you may not have noticed while playing it.